that many. So, um, you guys, have you tracking on APRS? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. it's heading back towards Illinois. Yeah. Yeah. We'll do that. Oh. But how did it get here? I mean, it got all the way up to here. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, think about it. On the way down, it's going to go through the same winds, which means even though it seems to be going that way, it's going to burst. Come back. It's going to go like that. Oh, okay, that makes sense. <laughs> when it bursts, uh, by the way, did you guys notice the scent rate about 800 yeah. something? Yeah. A little over here. A little slower than we expected. Yeah. We're in India. Um, and so, I'm a Hoosier, I can say this. Um, <laughs> we generally are going to do, we're going to assume it's probably about a 1,500, uh, maybe a little less, uh, feet per minute descent rate. Which means it's almost doubled what our sound is. So what you do, is once we burst, we have the most accurate sounding, better than any National Weather Service, because we did it. Uh, and it's right now. So we'll have an ascent path. What you do is you take that ascent path, and since, like I'm saying now, we're probably going to do 50% of that. So you take the same data, you can do this mentally, and just kind of mirror it, and switch it by 50%. So take that, the, you could probably describe like the way that you kind of... Is it a little slow? Yeah. It's twice as much. Yes. And so that's why I think right about here, I mean, we can, I was hoping for a break or two in the clouds, and yeah, we might have some. And we could, especially with the soundings, with the soundings, we should be able to spot it. Might be a good chance. Okay. Uh, you guys got binoculars? I got a pair. Oh, there's one out.